I just got in our second workout of the day and it was uh, an, an intense one. I'm sure you guys just saw a little bit of that footage. My thought for you today on day 23 is this. You will either pay now for what you want or you will pay later for what you don't want. How do you know when to like listen to like either like your body or like listen to yourself about like stuff like burnout? Like when should you keep going and then when should you like really kind of hold yourself back and be like this is not healthy? Where's that line between what is good for you and what's not? Like when you have the opportunity yeah. to say like sleep in or something mm -hmm. and you're like, well, dang, I could get up. But it's like I've been, you know, grinding all this week. Yeah, I think it depends on what you're doing. Like it depends on what sleeping in is taking you away from. Like if you're working on something that you're super passionate about, that you know is making an impact, that you know is, you know, using what God put in you, then you probably should get up and do it. You know what I mean? Um, but that being said, like, you have to listen to your body. There's been a really cool theme um, from the vlog that went out yesterday, uh, the, the My Living Legacy vlog. A cool theme of stuff I've been really, you know, wrestling with this week is, like, this idea of, like, one way or the other, you're going to pay. You can either pay now or you're going to pay later. And then we took it a step further on another recap video where I said, you're either gonna pay now for what you want, or you're gonna pay later for what you don't want. And so if you think about that, like what does that mean? So I'm gonna pay now, let's just, let's just use body as an example. I'm gonna pay now and go through pain now and go through struggle now and go through being super tired now to get the body that I want, or by not doing it now, I'm going to pay later but later I'll be paying to get out of the body that I didn't want, you know what I mean? And so I think the moral of that story is that you're gonna pay one way or the other. I'd much rather pay for what I want than have to pay for what I don't want because I think when you pay for what you don't want, you're always gonna pay more. Mm -hmm. I think there's more joy like paying for it, like because like in being intentional about it, um, instead of paying for it because you kind of have to, like, because there's no other option at this point, you know, yeah. because your your health is so bad that you kind of have to at this point, otherwise you're gonna die, yeah. you know? Yeah. So um, I think, I think it's, really yeah, I think it's definitely a whole different mood when, yeah, when, when you're proactive about it. When you're looking at choosing, the exact same parallel from rent or lease or mortgage is the very same with your body. It's just the very same with your business. Like, why wouldn't you just pay it up front? Like, why wouldn't you pay it in full um, every single day um, to get what you ultimately want, to not have to go to the increased struggle and increased pain of having to pay to get out of what you didn't want um, down the road? 